Hi everyone and welcome to another shaving video and in this video I'm going to um, use a different blade but some very um, familiar <coughs> other products and the reason there's two reasons for this I wanted to do a video uh, shaving video anyway and um, I'd had a request of someone who uh, is the 22nd of January today and yesterday someone in Scotland who watches these videos <coughs> Cariza 5 Cariza 5 he didn't give me a name in the message you sent me but it was your 50th birthday yesterday so a very happy birthday belated happy birthday for yesterday now if you celebrate your birthdays in Scotland as you do celebrate New Year I think it's a good thing I'm doing this video a day later because um, I doubt you'll be in a fit state to even watch it really <laughs> anyway I hope you had a wonderful 50th birthday and life begins at 40 so you're well into it and he asked if I could use those blades specific blades Supermax stainless and putting it in my Edwin Jagger DE89L which stands for lined <laughs> not long, lined as you can see there there's the lines on the handle so I've just come out the shower and uh, here we go I'm taking this uh, blade out and if you haven't watched these videos before or whatever this is DE shaving going back to the old way of shaving really the only way of shaving using a double edged blade so there is the Supermax stainless going on the head of the Edwin Jagger DE89 put it together uh, three piece razor no settings, no adjustments just as it is the quality build of one of these is absolutely fantastic uh, beautifully finished and a good razor so I'm just going to re-wet my face because uh, it was nice to see Steve Farragher as well put a few videos up I'm not sure if he gets time to watch these but uh, he does a lot on Facebook on the big shave and He's got uh, his radio, community radio in in Liverpool, Kensington and also uh, he's got his partner Sheila, he's got two new dogs, one being deaf and um, he's a busy man I should think. Anyway, Wilkinson sword brush, nothing special about that, normal mixing bowl. Oh, I haven't told you, this is the soap. I thought I'm using a Supermax blade, so I'm using the Supermax Ultimate Shaving Cream. Relatively cheap cream to buy in um, some of the like Super Savers, Home Bag, well not Home Bargains, Super Savers and shops like that if you look around. Some supermarkets sell it as well. And uh, I've just put a bit of a blob in and it's coming up. Nice smell to this. Nice and creamy this, so there's about two or three days growth there three days I think yeah on the third day and uh, I've had a haircut and of course as soon as I had a haircut it went frosty in the morning a good bit of growth here so it'll be a good test for this blade So I hope you're all okay. Right then, off we go. First pass, Edwin Jagger DE89 using the Supermax stainless blade, brand new. And uh, here we go. Happy birthday, Carissa 5.
That's a very good blade. Very good blade. The Edwin Jagger is not an aggressive razor. You can change the settings on it, um, but it's not a mild razor in my eyes. It's just above the Wilkinson Sword Classic, uh, just slightly above it, which makes it. Um, I mean, look at this, going straight through these. Fantastic. No issues so far. Yeah, it's a good, um, the Edwin Jag is a good sort of mid-range razor. Especially in quality build. God. But as I say, I think a lot of the success to any razor is keeping it clean and unclogged during the shave. Now, to be fair, that's a, that's a good lot of growth there. First pass. That performed very well. Very nice. On to the second pass. And this cream is lovely. Maybe they complement each other. I've left this cream relatively thick, as you can tell, because uh, it glides. Much better. And on to the second across the growth pass. There's no dragon. Listen to that. I reckon. You put this blade in the murk of future, and uh, you could hire it out to a farmer to cut down the hay. I tell you that. Nah, fair play. That's a good and. Uh, It's not an aggressive blade. Um, but it does the job just nicely. How would I what would I compare that blade to personally? Um, I would say it's got similarities. 
somewhere on the uh, Wilkinson sword in my eyes because um, that's one of the main ones I use and it's quite similar quite similar it may last longer actually I don't know I'd have to use it over a period of a week or something to see how many shaves I'd have out of it third and final pass but I would say yes yeah, somewhere around there it's a good good blade does the job and it's uh, without shadow of a doubt it's going into a damn good razor using the Edwin Jagger I mean, come on, listen to that, hey! That's got to get, uh, got to get excited. Listening to that. Well, I tell you, there's nothing too cut on the neck area. If you could hear that. But you just come to the chin area, you'll hear it. Just a touch there. Double chin time then. Right then, just onto the moustache area. Left the cream on slightly longer this time, so uh, I can just start off on the twist, on the turn, and then bring the blade up. If you suffer, as you know, from sensitive skin, Especially on the moustache area. It's a great help just coming in that way. Coming in, I'll go this way. Coming in like that and gradually turning the blade. Because if you come straight in like that, God, you can pull and tug, and if it slips, you'll cut yourself. Just very pleased with that. Look at that. Very nice. So like you said, I don't know your name, Carisa5 from Scotland. You said you couldn't find any videos showing the Edwin Jagger DE89L uh, using the Supermax stainless blade. Well, there's one on YouTube now. <laughs> Not that I don't know if it's any good. <clears throat> but it's done its job. And uh, for cutting, for, in my opinion, it's quite similar to the Wilkinson sword blade um, but I think it may last a bit longer than the Wilkinson sword but I'd have to use it for a week or so just to see how many shaves I get out of it Cologne today is going to be British aftershave lotion from Boots the Chemist and it's forest fresh nice smell this Woody, very woody. Well, forest fresh. <laughs> ah, that's nice. Very nice. Soon evaporates. Right. Moisturising cream. 
give it the old arco. Got cold weather here at the moment, so a nice thick cream to give us a bit of protection. I'm going to be filming outside this evening, and if it's cold, I'll be glad of this. Tell you what, combination of the smell of that cologne and this arco, that's, that's quite pleasant that. You see, you try these things and sometimes you'll hit a combination which you'll think, oh I really like that. And then, you know, that leads to even happier shaving and you can't wait to shave. But take your time. So, just to recap then, using the Edwin Jagger DE89L, which stands for long, uh, which stands for lined. <laughs> It'll be all right in the night. And um, there you go, there's the lines on the handle. I'll get it right one of these days. And using <laughs> the red mixing bowl, Wilkinson salt brush and of course inside there was the Supermax stainless blade which comes in envelope like that Supermax stainless brand new and I've used the Supermax Ultimate 3 uh, shaving cream and by that in Britain very, relatively cheap I've seen it in some supermarkets and in places like Super Savers, um, Poundland, places like that, you'll see them. Um, relatively cheap. And then I use Boots, Boots the Chemist Aftershave Lotion, uh, Forest Fresh. Nice stuff, very nice smell, very woody. Somewhere along the lines to, uh, what did I say? Old spicy type of not that smell, but um, that type type of thing. And just to finish off, Arco Classic Moisturising Cream. So that's it. So thanks for watching. Uh, hope you had a good birthday in Scotland. Thanks to everybody else, and I'll see you in the next shaving video.